<laughs> Stuck again. There's Mother Teresa. <laughs> Oh no, I'm left behind! Welcome to Fraser Island, the largest sand island in the world. Which you can only get around in in a 4x4, so we roped our friends Daisy and Vic into bringing us on an epic adventure. First up, Lake Burbank. Daisy's having a wash for the day. We have no showers or toilets or anything for the whole three days, do we? No. No, no toilets for three mm. days? Vic's gonna teach us how to um, how to do a mush poo. <laughs> so that should be fun. But before all that exciting stuff, Vic's gonna teach us how to paddleboard. Josh is learning how to paddleboard for the first time. You're feeling uh, the pressure. Right. No pressure. I'm, I'm a beginner. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus! <laughs> 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 He's heading into shore. <laughs> you can also just pull board like that if you want. <laughs> So after a fun day on the lake, we headed to find our first camp spot. So this is our camp spot for the night. Absolutely buzzing. What do you reckon? Excited. So good, isn't it? So we finally set our camp. Our tent almost blew away after five minutes of being set up. We're being harassed by flies, but apart from that, it's awesome. You know that I wanna stay this way so we finally arrived at Lake Mackenzie. We set off at half four this morning from our campsite. And um, we got up at four and packed everything away. Um, it's now 6 a.m. The sun's already risen. We missed it. it. Took us a little bit longer than what we thought. Um, but yeah. We're here. Looks beautiful. So after yesterday's shit show of Josh getting on the paddleboard, here he is today, doing such a good job. You go, Bobby. We definitely recommend getting there at 6am to enjoy this little slice of paradise all to yourself for a few hours. It's time for a bite to eat, followed by a bumpy ride to find the famous Eli Creek. So we've just pulled off, pulled up at Eli Creek, which is a freshwater creek, is it? Yeah. Which is a freshwater creek. And everyone gets in dinghies and just goes for a little stroll down to the to the ocean. I'm ready to go. <laughs> you look like a proper Aussie. I do. <laughs> Chill in Alana. Josh clearly couldn't wait for his turn to float down the creek on an inflatable unicorn. Oh, we're having a romantic little float down the creek. And Daisy and Vic's gonna have a go. Valentine's Day tomorrow, so this is your present. This is our little date. <laughs> not bad. It's not bad at all. Feeling super fresh after floating down Eli Creek. We had around a two-hour journey up to find our next camp spot. But first, we had to cross South Nagala Rocks, which is a notorious spot for people getting bogged. So I think we've just got a bit bogged. Let's see what's happening. So we're having to use the max tracks to put onto the tires to get us out of here. Never seen this before. <laughs> oh my god. You look like an old granny. Dig, Bobby, dig. You can do this, Vic. Stuck again. Not looking good. 
there's Mother Teresa. <laughs> <laughs> you right now, Josh. Oh, for fuck's sake, that didn't get us very far. So, two guys have come to our rescue. Stop it, stop it. We made it, finally. <laughs> So well, we've just arrived at our camp number two. It's absolutely unreal. We're bang next to a massive sand dune, bang on the ocean. We've got Vic, the man himself, putting our shower up right now. So this shower, we just stick it in the sun during the day and it heats up and then it's a toasty shower for, for in the evenings. We're all set up, the beers are out and we got to enjoy a beautiful sunset to end the day. Boys are cooking breakfast. I think there's enough sausages there, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> Look at that. You guys proud of this? Yeah, very proud. And during breakfast, we spotted something amazing. Here. Look at it. These beautiful creatures were playing in the shallows just a few feet from our camp. It was amazing, an unforgettable experience during our trip on Freezer Island. We decided to all get covered up from the sun, especially me, and go for a walk along the beach and see what else we could find. <laughs> We seen turtles, sharks, stingrays. It was absolutely incredible. Unfortunately, as it's stinger season, we're unable to swim in the water, but we got to drone and see them from afar. So to bring our Freezer Island adventure to an end, we decided to watch the sunset from the top of the sand dunes. Our next stop is Erle Beach, where we're going to explore the Great Barrier Reef. Make sure you subscribe! Thanks for watching.